ES Opay Plans Theater Company. And we have put together a nice uh, production for 2011. So we want you to enjoy it. Uh, it's uh, it's going to be a good day. It's going to be a good time. So have fun. into his subconscious. Oh, I'm so good at this. I love analyzing dreams. Does he have twin dreams? Simonson, does he have twin dreams? Yeah, I think he must. Yeah, where's Tavish? This should be interesting. Hey, what does physics have to do with dreams? Well, um, actually, nothing. Oh, perfect. All right, well, let's see what's on the mind of Charlie this Christmas. a doctor about that. And tea spray. How about tea spray? A little hand over tea spray there. Everybody, hand over tea spray. A little shout out for Bradshaw. Hmm, that was uh, some pretty high society Christmas back in the old days of Oak Bay behind the Tweed Curtain. That was a yearly ritual in this gym, Mr. Simonson. Yeah, yeah, those were the days, hey? I miss those days. Hey, uh, do, you, uh, do you watch Glee? No, I've never seen that. I, I stick with Seinfeld. What the deuce is Glee? Well, <laughs> all that already then. Uh, back to our little dreamer. Uh, there might be something a little more mainstream coming up next uh, in Charlie's dream sequence.
fantastic. Charlie, 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 you are a total gleek. I had no idea you loved us so much. Yeah, it's weird, hey? Do you ever notice how awkward teachers are when they're dancing? But uh, I gotta say, Kinnear was absolutely delightful. Give it up for Mr. Kinnear. Okay, Charlie, the Nutcracker followed by Glee. Charlie, what is going on in that head of yours? It's so weird. It must be Kaz's influence, don't you think? And uh, peering into his subconscious, it seems our dreamer is aware of some of the other holidays that people love. Um, I heard he celebrates Jimbo Christmas. How many celebrate Jimbo Christmas out there? A couple of hardcore fans. Okay, uh, but you know what? What the Chuck Norris is Jimbo Christmas? Well, all I know is it involves a large amount of chicken strips. Um, but apparently, it's on Wikipedia. What, really? November 23rd? Yeah. 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 What, really? It counts as in next year. Okay, so Charlie, with him, whatever. I know that Charlie really celebrates Festivus. Special place in his heart for Festivus. For the rest of us. How about the Festivus crew? Are we kind of ready? Okay, so at this point in time, uh, Mr. Simonson, what were you doing in 1997? Oh, that was a great year. Well, uh, I was celebrating Festivus with my family. Uh, how many people out there were born in 1994? Hands up. Fibers out there. How many, how many 97s? Um, anybody in 1992? Oh, good. That's good. Okay, no grade 13s. Perfect. Okay, here we are, Festivus, for the rest of us. <laughs> I, uh, I celebrate festivals. It's nothing. It's a stupid holiday my father invented. It, it, it doesn't exist. Many Christmases ago, I went to buy a doll for my son. I reached for the last one I had, but so did another man. As I rained blows upon him, I realized there had to be another way. What happened to the doll? It was destroyed. But out of that, a new holiday was born. A Festivus for the rest of us. Happy Festivus tonight. We gather your family around you and tell them all the ways they have disappointed you over the past year. And is there a treat? No, instead there's a fault. Requires no decoration. I find tinsel distracting. Frank, this new holiday of yours is scratching me right where I itch. Let's do it then. All right. Festivus is back! I'll get the power on the crawl space. Welcome to the colors. The tradition of Festivus begins with the airing of grievances. I got a lot of problems with you people. Now, you're going to hear about it. Charlie's phone, and we got some awesome Festivus tweets coming in. Uh, these are these are awesome. Okay, here we go. Uh, here's the first tweet. Is it true that Mr. Cristante goes over to Mr. Allen's house to use his tanning bed? <laughs> Charlie, you're gonna hear about that one, Charlie. Yeah, and uh, so here's the next one we saw was so what's with the cat? or dog in the library this year anyway. Yeah, and uh, this one just says, what's with Sheffer and the Diet Coke? <laughs> so uh, this is uh, the grade 12's uh, brought this one to Charlie. I'm not sure about this one too. He says, what's with tea spray show? Yo, hey team, let's hit some ribs. <laughs> tea spray, you are the riddle. Totally riddle. Um, and, uh, and here's one. 
Where's Waldo? I mean, where's Price when you need him? <laughs> Here's, uh, we got a couple more here. Uh, does Atkinson know that he's always covered in chalk? <laughs> maybe that's why he, uh, maybe that's why he only wears rugby shirts. Protection. Uh, what about Miss S? Why is it that when she's yelling at you, she has that smile? Freaks me out. <laughs> And uh, the last one was, what, what's with Simonson? Uh, you know that spot in the back of his head? Did he really have a punk tattooed in there that he got removed? I think he did. Ah, uh, people love Festivus. Give it a hand. <laughs>